guys, how's it going? It's the Height here, and we're back with a brand new episode of Autonauts the Mega Edition. D Nikki, I've never seen that before. Does it change? Maybe I'm crazy. I don't know. I'm probably crazy. Anyway, what I want to do first things first a oh, blue marlin. That could be. Oh, look at that. There's one right there. Okay. And then we need bread and butter pudding raw and Santa's coats. Not a problem because we've got this little buddy here. Bread and butter pudding. Raw. Oh, and I also need him to take it out of there. How many times do I need that? 21. And then what's the next thing? Santa coat. That should be over here. Santa coat. And I need 30 of those. Awesome. Okay, I got the Marlin. Let's put that in there. Beautiful. Okay, so. Oh my god. Guys, in the last episode, we finished buying all of the hats. I think it's hats. And in today's episode, what I want to do is build all the things for them. So, what was the last thing we were making? Those things? I think they unlock in order. Let's just plunk this down and see what happens. Okay. Uh, helmets. Are we making the fox? I don't... Oh, yeah, we are. Okay, and we're making that one. The helmet, the bunny, the bird. Okay, so then the next one's frog. Frog, panda, bird. We gotta do all of these. Now, I'm not sure they're all gonna fit here. It would be great if they would. Ah, oh, they're not gonna fit. What if I turn them around? Is that gross? I think it's gross. I don't know if I like it, but I don't have room. I, ah, uh, what? Do we just build them somewhere else? Maybe we just build them somewhere else. I don't want to make a mess of this room. What if I just build them right here? How many of these do I need? Maybe we start with that. How many of these do I need? Floor. Flooring required, of course. Uh, let's just get something under there for now. Oh, and it needs walls too. I hate this. Does a fence work? I just have a lot of fences right now. There we go. We need two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 15 of those. All right, let's see what we can do here. All right, so I got this little room here set up. I think this should be all... Oh, I don't have any doors. <laughs> oh my God, I'm gonna need a few. Let's put a few doors in here. Um. Yeah, something like that. Oh, can't put a door on top of a wall. Okay, there we go. And it looks like my robots are using this as a means of transportation, so I may as well... I may as well give them a little bit of a speed boost if they're gonna go through here anyway. Okay, so we need... Do we need frog first? Should just double check, make sure... No, not... Oh yeah, frog, not dino. Dino. Okay. Panda. Oh, oh, oh. I didn't mean to do that. Whatever, we'll fix it after. No, I just did panda. Burb. What is this? Bearskin hat? Weird. Okay. I really hope we did this right. And then five more. 
Oh yeah, we did it. We did it. Okay, perfect. So now all I got all. <laughs> now all I have to do is program a bot for each of those. And I'm thinking I should be able to copy this guy. I think. Wool blanket, thread, cloth. Let's just see. I haven't actually looked at the recipe yet. Wool blanket. Wait, why is there coal? Ah, uh, maybe it's not quite the same. Anyway, I'm gonna copy or program all of these guys. We're gonna get them all set up here. And I will see you guys right after that's done. Okay, guys, so we got all of the hats being made, I think. Let me just make sure I've got more than one in all of these so that I know they're working. Something's fishy with this one. Aha. You're not supposed to go to the bench with it. You're supposed to go there. Okay, drop that. All right. I think that should have it. 14, 4, 39. Looking good. Okay, so that means we have built every single item in the game. I'm pretty sure. All the craftable ones. Anything that can be built in a... In a workbench. Except for potentially, like, vehicles. I don't have a vehicle station. Except for trains. But trains are the, what we're using, so I don't really care about wheelbarrows and... I don't know. Stuff like that. <laughs> I mean... I, I, I don't know. We don't need them. We don't need them. So, I still have to clean up this area yet. We haven't done that. And I have all these stones up here I gotta get rid of as well. Okay, so what I want to work on now is, I guess... <sighs> Honestly, I think what I need to do is get villagers and get them into every single one of these houses that we just put down in the last episode. I'm thinking that's kind of what I need to do. So, what that means is I need to get rid of this. Where's my incubator? Get rid of that. Let us... How do I want to do this? I think I want to set up a spot over here. And I'm going to use a couple bots for this. I think. Because this is going to be a pain in the butt. So what's going to happen is this is going to be the baby maker. <laughs> uh, and how do I want to... I'm going to just... So that I know where these guys are later, I'm going to just put a hyphen at the front. And I should be able to search for their names and delete them all. We're not going to need them for a super long time. So all I want this guy to do is come over here and use the dispenser. Okay, and then I want him to pick up a baby and put it in there. Repeat forever. So he should, he shouldn't be able to put the second one in until that one's empty. And in fact, I might actually add a if empty. So that he doesn't just make them forever. Okay, now we need a hyphen... A hyphen baby incubator. And all I want this guy to do is take food from here. And put it in here. And that should just be it. Forever. So now we should be getting babies. I think.
Okay, that's looking good. And then it should stop. Okay, it does. It stops. Because I don't want just a pile of babies. So, because <laughs> that would be bad. Okay, so now this guy is going to be called Stork because he's going to deliver the babies. And he's just going to come over here. He's going to take a baby. And he's going to take them and plunk them over here, I guess, for now. We got to get one in each of these spaces. Repeat forever. And I'm going to have to change what he's looking for. But for now, that will work. Two, four, six, eight, nine. That, I, I think nine was the magic number that we went with, right? Yes, sir. Okay, now I need actually all these guys need is some tier one food, which I think is just carrots straight up And housing so they're gonna need logs, but I've got logs right here Okay, so it is just carrots. Let me get some bots set up for the tier one thing since that's where we are right now anyway tier one food Actually, I want to see what I called these guys. I want to be consistent with the naming. How are things looking here? Where are my guys? Tier 7 food unloader. Okay, so this guy would be tier 1 food. No, not unloader. That was the train guy. I don't want the train guy. Here, food, tier seven food giver. Uh-huh, uh-huh, that makes much more sense. Where am I? Where's my bot? Okay, let me do this real quick and we'll meet back up. No, it's not tier seven, tier one food giver. And we'll meet back up once this is done. I just realized we're starting to run out of these skulls to garbage stuff so we're gonna need a bunch more of those here right away I think so we'll get that going and okay we got the food guy going oh we need the repair guy okay so we got the food guy here we got the repair guy here but nothing needs repairing yet so he's just gonna have to hang out and wait we've got the wolf guy not putting Love away. Oh, until hands are not empty. Wrong. Okay, we got the love guy putting love away. Now, I need to take the stork. Actually, I'm gonna have to pick up one of these babies. And reprogram this guy. To look over here now. Ta-da! And we need you in there. There we go. Special delivery. Okay, so we got the tier three guys going. Or tier tier two. Tier one. Wait. Did I skip a tier? Oh, these guys need stone bricks. Okay, we haven't done that yet. I gotta do that. I gotta do that. That's what this train is supposed to be for. I think. We're making stone bricks somewhere. We're making them right here. Mm, that's not the best. I'm going to have to... How am I going to do this? The train is going to have to come across. Go up. I almost need to add a train stop in here so that it'll stop. And then back up. That will work. And then we have to branch off somewhere. Somewhere in here.
And then we come over. Oh, damn. Perfect. And then we'll come up. Come on. What are you doing? And then we'll come up. Up. Like that. I'm not sure if we're going to need more trains for the other items here. I may as well just set this up now. Because I would hate to have to do it later once we have no room. So I will just set this up like that. And we'll have a whole bunch of spots for our trains to come in. And actually, bad news, I don't have enough train track for all of this, so we're gonna have to... Oh my god. The trains, man. Oh no. <laughs> oh, it hates the, the... Look at... Oh, it just keeps freezing every time I do something. Oh yeah, so what I was saying before is I've got these bots all set up here. These ones are all set up here. I need to get a train bot here. Let's see. Tier 7 housing train. Why not? I think I have a train program. I do. Now, how do I want to do this? I was using this a whole bunch. And now it's been a while since I used it, so I don't really remember. Find nearest train in... Here. Please? Okay, and then we have to get rid of all of the actual moving stuff, because none of that is applicable. Awesome. And you know what I just thought of? I probably don't need... Oh man, I'm gonna have to run all the way across the map. I probably don't need this train stop because what I'm gonna wanna do is my train is gonna wanna come all the way up and down, stop at the refueling station, and then go back. Because if I don't, eventually it's just gonna run out of fuel. So yeah, we're not gonna even use this train station that I just plunked down. All right, so we're in. We don't need that part. I have to do this and this and this and this. Okay, now let's go forward. Make sure the train is all good. Yes, and we want to stop there. Perfect. On the way back, we're going to want to turn this way this way and that should be good so here we go on our adventure i don't need a train stop at the end i was doing it before like uh, in areas like this but we don't even need it because the train will just go to the end of the track and then stop so all of these train tracks were not required not train tracks train stations train stations all right, so stop at the fueling station. Good, go backwards. Good, good, good. Look at him go. Okay, and then all of this stuff I want right in here. So after it's empty, he's gonna do all of that. Then after it's full, he's gonna go forward. This time I think I do want him to stop here. So he doesn't have to just go there and waste an extra time filling up. I think he should be fine. Okay, and then we're going to go back. Make sure all of these tracks are lined up properly. This one is not. Okay. So that should be that, I think. Oh, yeah. I forgot. We were putting hats on our train conductors when we first started, and then we kind of just stopped. We were putting hats on everybody when we started. We might have to we might have to do that again at some point. Now that all of the clothing is being made. Okay, perfect. I want all of this 
after the full. And that should be it. He should just go and do his thing. Perfect. Now all I gotta do is wait for him to fill up, get back here, and then I can program a bot to... I was going to put stuff into here, but one of you guys left me a comment at the end of the video and was like, at the end of my last video, and was like, why are you taking stuff out of here, putting it into there, when you can just take stuff out of here and put it into here? So, I mean, I have no good argument for why I would do that. The best thing I could think of is there's no downtime in in the method where the train goes and gets stuff and then comes back and I'm taking right out of the train. Well, the train is not here. Nothing was working here, but I don't care. I really don't care. So this is just over redundant and I don't need it. So we're just going to... Oh, I also have to program about to put stuff in, obviously. Derp. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and do that and we'll meet up right after. Alright, there we go. We got the bricks being brought over to our castles here. And how are things looking over here? I guess I have to reprogram this boy now. He's not going to be looking... Is there a bot in here? Or not a bot. Is there a baby? There should be. There should be a baby down there. Got him. Okay. So I'm going to reprogram this bot to start bringing babies over here. How are my huts doing? Oh, they're broken. Okay. Good to know. We're going to have to move this guy and get him to actually start doing something with those. I think... These ones take planks, if I'm not mistaken. So we're going to have to get planks from somewhere. Ooh, that's a long haul. I might have to get a wheelbarrow guy set up for this. Just so that... I don't want to train hauling planks down here. It just seems very annoying. I don't know. We'll see. Let me just get this guy set up here, moving babies to our next little housing area. In here. Come on. You can do it. There we go. There's that. Let's run down here really quick. Get this guy set up to fix those houses. I'm going to have to figure out what we want to do with the planks. I don't think I want to train all the way down here and I'm not sure it's going to be that efficient to just have one guy hauling with a backpack full. It might not be the best. Okay, repeat. Come over here. Dump in there. Repeat until your hands are empty. That should just work. Oh, he's going to go load up again. Anyway, it's fine. Okay, so there's that, guys. I think we're going to wrap this episode up here. It's pretty good. We got two new housing areas set up. We got all of the hats finished. And we finally finished getting the castles fully functional, including the repairing. So that's not bad. I think there's only... Let's see, one house here... Obviously these ones, so two, we're missing something. Three? Is there only three houses left to do? Hang on, something's, something's fishy here. Where's my houses? We got that one. We just did this one. One, two, three. There's only three houses left to do and we're done. Well, that ain't so bad after all. So I might go ahead and do that off camera. I'm not sure. It's kind of boring to watch me set up housing. So, I mean, I might do that off camera. I'm not sure what's left to do, guys. We've got almost everything. I know we have to work on the marching band. That is something that I really wanted to do. But we're starting to run out of stuff. It feels pretty good, actually. After, like, you know... What is this? 14 months of playing Autonauts? <laughs> we finally, finally got to a point where it's like, 
Man, yeah, we're almost done. Let me unlock all of these instruments. While we're here. Oh man, it feels good, guys. It feels good. Can I unlock them all, or are we gonna run out of money? Is this an instrument? The jaw harp? Looks like it is. The only thing we have left are the two doggos and... Man, that is gonna take six daily achievements to get. Ouchie Wawa. Or... 60 of the non-daily achievements. I think it's only 10 per one. Let's go look. All of my musical instruments have been dropped off here for us. That is lovely. Look at this. Oh man, so maybe we can get something set up. <laughs> oh, that is too good. Okay, anyway. Um, let me just take a look here and see what our mission objectives are. I think they're all kind of crap. Yeah, the sheep one is never going to go away till we do it. The mahi-mahi. Oh yeah, and then that other fish one. Is there a mahi-mahi over here I can steal? I don't think so. Hello? I don't think so. Okay. Well, it was worth a try. Whoops. Yeah. Anyway. I think we're going to wrap this episode up there, guys. Let me know how you're liking the series in the comments below. Is this mega enough for you? Have we have we mostly done it? I think we've mostly done it. We're getting super close anyway. We still have to do something with the catapults yet. I'm not sure what I want to do with those. Where even are they? Here they are. I've not used these things at all yet, so maybe in the next one we can play around with them a little bit. <laughs> Could be fun. But yeah, other than that, guys, I hope you like it. If you did, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>